and eventually she passed away. They say on the 17th of the month of Ramadan in the year 58 of the Hijrah. And she was around the age of 66 years old. And she had requested for Abu Hurairah radiallahu an to pray her janazah prayer because he was still alive. And so he prayed the janazah prayer of Aisha radiallahu anha and she was, she was buried in Baqi uh, during the night because uh, she was uh, someone who, won, who was modest and as a result of the modesty and the fact that she was a woman, she wanted uh, her body to be buried uh, in darkness so no one could see her. And that's why she was buried uh, after the Isha prayer, after the Witr prayer um, in Baqi. And this is the life of Aisha radiallahu anha. And of course, one of the greatest lessons we can learn uh, about her life is, as we have learned from the other lives of the women in Islam, is how they play a prominent role in Islam. I mean, she even had like, you know, a, a role to play with regards to, you know, questioning the decisions of Ali radiallahu anhu, who was the leader of the Muslims. And this shows us, you know, her, her, the, the way, how vocal she was, you know, and the way she would carry herself and the, the confidence she had. And we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that we benefit from what we heard and that Allah